I, I, it was, you know, perhaps there's a New York personality there, but no, I, I think he understood. I, I can't help myself even in this very serious situation. I, you know, if you take yourself too seriously, the world sort of sucks. You got to have a little bit of fun with it. So, so I did. We had some, you know, quips in the courtroom. The first time I was here, sort of gave me a fist bump on the way out. I guess I had a rather snappy response to something that was I can't even remember what it was right now. And he said that was really funny. And sort of. So, you know, you what, what, your dad. Listen, I, I'm not gonna. I, I, I don't even know how far the gag order applies. So, you know, I, I don't need to do that and put myself. I mean, enough crosshairs, guys. Uh, you know, but again, this was about the attorney general going after and prosecuting their political enemies. And if you don't believe that, just listen to what she said before she was ever attorney general. Right? We're gonna go after Trump. We're gonna get. It's well, we're in New York. It's bullshit. Okay, is what it is. But but that doesn't matter because it's also New York, because it is so one, one-sided. Uh, and, you know, that's the reality of the world in which we live today. So we gotta, we gotta play accordingly. Uh, but I imagine, you know, as you'll hear from our other experts and witnesses and the banks and everyone, they'll totally back up our side of the story. I just don't know that any of that matters because unfortunately it doesn't feel like, you know, we're playing by the rules, we're playing by a one-sided system of justice. So, why, why is there thanks guys.